everyone, welcome back. My name is Julia and this video is going to be all about my goals for 2019. So my first goal is to pay off my Discover card, which will happen this Friday, January 4th. I actually want to get rid of this card by the end of the year. I am missing that goal by four days, but I don't really care because either way, that card will be paid off and I can close it out, I can close the account and cut it up. So that's what I'm look looking forward to. And you will make that payment with me this Friday, so that video will be filmed and uploaded Friday morning, so watch out for that video. Uh, my second goal this year is to pay off at least $15,000 in debt. I paid off just under eleven grand in 2018. Um, I don't think I ever had like a set number I want to pay off X amount in 2018, but I am doing that for 2019. So I want to pay off at least 15 grand. If I pay off more, great. If not, doesn't matter, but at least 15000 by the end of the year. Uh, my third goal for the year is so since my Discover card will be paid off this Friday, I had to come up with my next smallest loan would actually be my Discover student loan with a with a minimum payment of $50 a month and the balance is around $2,900. However, my car loan, the balance is around $5,900 and I have a $500 minimum payment every month. So I just want to get rid of that and free up that $500. So that's what I will do. That's what, that's what I'm going to focus on. Um, to start after I make this payment on Friday for my Discover card. Uh, my fourth goal is to adhere to the Dave Ramsey plan for a second year. So I signed up for Dave Ramsey mid-2016, fell off in 2017. 2018 was my first full year actually sticking to the plan. So I want to make 2019 my second full year sticking to the plan. Uh, my fifth goal is to only use sinking funds for stuff it's designated for. So. At the beginning of 2018, I set up a sinking fund to buy a new laptop because I need one. The current one I have is four years old now, I think, around four years old. And for now, it's still working, but it's starting to go. Like I'm having pro I'm having trouble with it. So I set up a sinking fund to save up, and I wanted to buy a new computer around August of 2018. That didn't happen because I am, for some reason. Even though I have an emergency fund, like I'm, I don't like using it, right? The whole point of having it is so if there's an emergency, I can use it. I hate using it though. For some reason, I don't want to use it. So I've been pulling from sinking funds for stuff that it's not designated for. So I need to stop that in 2019 so I can actually save up for things like my new laptop because after my laptop I need to start saving up for a phone I'm due for a phone in July of 2019 actually which I don't think I will actually get one but again we'll see where I'm at when the time comes um so that way I can actually save up for this stuff and buy it so that's the fifth goal and the sixth goal the sixth goal for this year is I want to cash flow as many emergency emergencies as possible so I'm, I still don't want to use my emergency fund if I don't have to. Like if something comes up and I have the money to deal with it in my checking account, I will just use that money and I will not touch my emergency fund. Um, however, if I do have to dip into another fund, if I don't have enough money in my checking account to save it, I will use my emergency fund and that's it. I'm not going to, I'm not going to rationalize, well, if I take money from my laptop sinking fund, no, none of that this year. I want to use my emergency fund because that's what it is for. It is for emergencies and my sinking fund, my sinking funds, I have more than one, are for what I set them up to for, right? My car maintenance, personal, laptop, things like that. So I'm only going to use the sinking funds for the stuff they are designated for and I'm only going to use, I will try to cash flow emergencies and if not, I will only go to my emergency fund. I will not pull money from any sinking fund. So those are my six goals for this year. Please let me know what your goals are for the in the comment section. And since there are a few other YouTubers who I know are making uh, 2019 goals videos like this, I will link all of their videos or their channels, I should say. I don't know when their videos are going up, but I will link their channels in the description box below. So please go check them out and see what their goals are as well. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.